who is Mark Elias? If Jay Brown is Harry Reid's bagman in the fishbowl of Nevada, who is Reid's partner in obfuscation in the larger o Washington Ocean of Influence? That role falls to attorney Mark Elias, who coincidentally represents John Podesta, Hillary Clinton, Robert Menendez, Senate Majority PAC, the DNC, and was the intermediary who paid Fusion GPS. Mark Elias is the chair of Power Washington law firm Perkin Coie's political law practice. He represents Democrats exclusively, including public officials, candidates, parties, corporations, tax-exempt organizations, and political action PACs in connection with campaign finance, government ethics, lobbying disclosure, and white-collar criminal defense matters. His clients also include Fortune 500 corporations, national nonprofit corporations, lobbying firms, individuals, candidates, and campaigns. In other words, if corruption and bribes systemically exist in the Democrat Party, Elias would be privy to all of the skeletons and even be acting in collusion. Elias was general counsel to Hillary for America, the presidential campaign of Hillary Rodham Clinton. He served in the same role for John Kerry's 2004 presidential campaign. Mark's clients include the National Democrat National Committee, Democratic Senatorial Campaign Committee, Democratic Congressional Campaign Committee, Democratic Governors Association, and U.S. Senators, Governors, Representatives, and their campaigns. More importantly, Elias has been implicated in the Fusion GPS Russian campaign scandal. While Clinton campaign lawyer Mark Elias vigorously denied his involvement in the anti-Trump Steele Memo dossier that has made up the substance of the Russian collusion allegations, his denial appears to have been intentionally misleading. Reports from the Washington Post show Elias hired opposition research firm Fusion GPS on behalf of the Clinton campaign and the Democrat National Committee. Elias reportedly hired Fusion to dig up dirt on Trump as part of a project that became the Trump dossier. Where this links to Harry Reid and John Podesta is that Reid was one of the first to voice fears of Russian election involvement. John Podesta had also met with the president of Fusion GPS in the same time frame, all in October of 2016. As lawyer to Podesta, Reid, Hillary Clinton, the DNC, and the Senate Majority PAC, the implication is that Elias would have been in the loop and perhaps even coordinating the, s the dissemination of the Steele dossier and the coordinated effort to tie Russia to the Trump campaign. Moreover, Elias was also advising indicted Senator Bob Menendez on his campaign finance reporting. When Menendez went to trial for attempting to get friend Dr. Solomon Melgen out of $8.9 million in Medicare fraud, Elias tried to present testimony to the court absolving Menendez of criminal intent. Not so coincidentally, Harry Reid and Senate Majority PAC had also played a prominent role in the Menendez bribe accusations. Surprisingly, Reid was not called by the prosecution to testify, likely at Elias' suggestion because of the possibility of self-incrimination.